YouTube, it's Bebop07 here, and welcome back to Niche and the Aura Tribe Reborn. Now in the last episode, uh, one of our Niche things got snapped up by this evil, evil meat-eating plant. How dare you? How dare you? But we managed to save him. It was actually Pear. We managed to save him. Uh, Islaisa went ahead and slapped it and totally destroyed it, but it's still, it's still red, so it's not safe for us to really go after right now. So as soon as we pass the turn, I'm scooting Elias away. I'm really hoping that it doesn't heal up and snatch her up because I saw that we could attack it and so I had her attack it, but I'm not sure if it's really doing anything. So we're gonna move her. But um, we also had some unbelievably stunning, stunning, beautiful children in the last episode. Like a huge batch of beautiful, gorgeous babies and I am just feeling so overwhelmed. We have little, we have little, um, Iris here, and she was the first, like, she just, wow, mind blown with her. She has stripes, she has really dark fur, and she has those bright yellow eyes, and she is really, really beautiful. And in my head, I see her as kind of graceful, too. And then we actually had Reven. I took forever trying to find a good name for him, but, oh, my word, he looks scary to me. He looks like he's really fierce, like really angry. Like, um, if you make him angry, he will come after you with a slow, burning passion for defeating you or something like that. He seems like a very fierce little baby, <laughs> but he's gorgeous too. And they are not the only ones. Oh, not the only ones. Let's see, we have Lineberry here. Let's go ahead and let's, let's look. We have some very stunning children over here. We actually have Loki's reincarnation, Roar, who's actually named after his father, Thor. And then we had Bun's last child, little, uh, little, let me click on you, little Tula. And it's hard for me to find a name for her too. I need something real simple, real sweet. And you guys suggest beautiful, complicated, elegant names. And it's like, ah, oh, oh, but we have Tulip here. So we have Tulip, and ah, oh, beautiful. She also has the stripes, but they're such a light pink. And it, they're kind of, they're a lot thinner than Iris's. So the contrast isn't quite as stark. You don't notice it as easily, but she's beautiful. Beautiful too. She just seems so sweet and gentle, and she is actually the youngest sister of, uh, of Velvet and Swiftwing. Uh, our twins. Swiftwing is our current chief. I'm gonna go ahead and change his last gem to match his other gems. And he and Scarlet are actually destined, um, totally destined to mate with each other because I think he finds her very charming. She's very, very sweet. She's kind and caring, but there's, there's some sort of, like, spice, I guess. Little, little bit of a, let's, I guess you could say spice, a little bit of a spice to her personality. So she's kind of, she can be kind of zippy and, and and quick, you know, with her retorts and everything. So I feel like he'd have fun bantering with her and just fun in general around her. But that wasn't the only thing that happened. We also ran into a rogue and I don't think I can get a very good camera shot of her. So I'm just going to go here. Let me go top side and let's see right here. She's actually really, really pretty, and uh, now that I look at her again, she's kind of pink, which is cute, but but uh, she does have D, which is something we don't have, but she's not really worth it, in my opinion. I don't think it's worth it, because she has a lot of bad genes, we have so many nichelings, so little food, so I don't particularly think that it would be worth bringing her in. And actually, ah, uh, she didn't get the K immunity from her father. Uh, that's okay. No, no biggie, no biggie. But um, we have slowly been making our way to the other ports, and I have decided we will only allow two more children to be born on this island, and we are going to start picking who's going with us. So the two babies that are going to be born, they aren't going to be from the new generation because the new generation is going to lead us on to the next one. And I think I'm going to start, like we'll still have them trying to cut through, but I think... I think we're gonna let Wineberry and a &R have another child, but we might wait a little bit on that. And I think instead she'll swipe this up and maybe she'll try for the Raise Arena if it comes over. So she'll stay here. We'll see if the Raise Arena comes her way. And then we have little Pear. Can you do anything? I don't know if he can gather anything. So 
he's going to come over here to stay by his mate. He's trying to swipe that bunny, but he can't. Can you? Ah! Oh, he didn't do enough damage. It's still alive. Okay, so what if we smell? Alright, so you don't need to protect this little one anymore. So if you go out over here, wrong move. And we have some bunny meat. Thank goodness. We really need to make use of our hunting more. So everybody over there is doing well. And actually, let's sniff. Listen, we're a little too far to judge that plant. But I think Scarlet might, might just scoot a little closer. Just to see if she could smell it. But she can't. Okay, so let's see if maybe Mocha, sorry, not Mocha, you look like Mocha, you don't really look like Mocha, uh, Raspberry Ripple can. It's green! That means we can harvest from it! So, okay, Poison Flower, Poison Flower, um, alright, I don't know if Scarlet can actually get this, but she swipes it, she's gonna swipe it open, and let's go ahead, ah, oh, gosh, let's zoom out, let's zoom out. So, Poison Flower is going to go over and... Uh, she can't even get there, really? Uh, this is right by the ape spawn tree. Uh, but she's going to collect food from this. Whew, that's very dangerous. This is very dangerous. But we need the food. We need it. There is no choice. But I think if we are going to have any other babies, we're going to try to hold off and send everybody to those other ports. And whoever's going to have them, has them way later. What was that? Is the razor runner within your reach? It is not. What a shame. But uh, we have Anar over here, and I don't know if we can smell anything else in this direction. That thing is still red, and we need to collect more food. Ugh, I hate having to be concerned about food. Definitely want to get some more diggers paw, that's for sure. But I think Raduknu is going to... Is that drowning you, buddy? Is that drowning you? Your head still is above water, so I think you're fine. Um, it looks like you could... Oh, no, he is drowning! Get out! I didn't... Yeah. What, is that deeper? Is that deeper? But it looks like he's over here, so at least we have an advantage. And doesn't look... I don't see anything, but we do have Kutak here, over here. I think he and Velvet are going to sneak across, but first one of them needs to gather from this. And I think one of them already did, so I guess he can go ahead. And he is slow. Gosh, he is slow. Anasi, move! Anasi! Please move! I don't wanna... I... I have to move. Ugh. Very rude. You are very rude, madame. Very, very rude. But Velvet... <gasps> Oh gosh! Oh, you're terrifying! Please don't steal our food! We need that stuff! Okay. Kari is going to- You butt chicken! You butt chicken! Wait a second, wait a second. Try to dig from this. Okay, it looks like you're not getting anywhere. Okay. Um... Ah! So I don't know what she's going for, but hopefully she won't be too much of a bother. Everybody over, over here, hmm. Swift wing, please, my friend, try to gather from this. Ah, we need that. We need the roots. We need it so badly. Is there anything else you can possibly dig up? Is there anything anybody around here can? Why don't you just clear that away? And Nasi, what are you going for? Don't you cause any issues. Are you going for this? If there's an ape, I really hope it doesn't get us. Okay, so we're doing this. But we're also going to plan who goes with us. So at the moment, we have almost 20 nichelings. Uh, that's crazy. We're just going to assume that every nicheling from the previous island is not going with us. Which means all of the younger ones too. But we have Tulip. She's G and A. She has no pop. We'll have to see. Velvet will probably go. She's B and I. Uh, for probable... I think I'm just going to go ahead and give her a red beginning. Because some of our nichelings still have the blue beginner gem and I'm too lazy to fix it. So we're going to give her a red gem signifying she'll go to the next island, along with Swiftwing. Um, well, Swiftwing's going no matter what, so we're gonna we're just going to leave that there and pretend that's an automatic thing. And we have B and G here. We have Scarlet. We have H and I with Scarlet, so Scarlet is going. She needs to go. She's one of our biggest, like, um, gene varieties, so we have H and I going. We have B and I going. 
And we have G and F. Okay, so we have G, F, I, and H going. So, you have G and A. We definitely- Oh, no, I didn't want to do that! Ah! We definitely want her to go with. So we have B and G too. What about you? We have A and G, and we have G and A with her as well. Mocha has F and B. So who could she- she could breed with Raspberry. She could breed with Raspberry. Ooh. She could... Okay, so they're... Okay. So we're just going to assume that these two are going for now. Because they do have pretty good genetics. And let's see. Okay, these two are definitely going. There's no doubt, no doubt about it. Because I love them and they are going. And she is the only one with the home island immunity. So she is most certainly going. And we have Isana. I'm not sure about her. We currently have... One, two, three, four, five. I don't know if I picked her yet. We have five uh, certain, wait, we have five, six, seven certain Nichlings going with us. And I think I'll go ahead and just say she can go. That's eight. And then we have nine. And I guess ten for now, for now. Um, we'll have to see. Some of these guys might not go with us. But now that that's done... <laughs> Let's just pass the turn. Uh, I'm so nervous. I don't like this. But now that you're here, swipe this up. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. You are not getting all those berries. Okay, that's done. That's decided. So we actually have. Let's see. Kutak here is going to scoot further in and clear this away behind him, whereas... Come on, can't you collect these guys? Oh, they're right here. He's fishing up all of this fish for us, and he's going to clear this away too. So, Velvet, um, maybe go here? Okay, so if we sniff... There's another berry bush up ahead, thank goodness! We're so low on food, this is terrible! Okay, collecting all the food that we can, and little fish it- No! <gasps> no! Isana! Isana, no! Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, this is so frustrating. Alright, alright, you're gonna have to be mama. You're gonna have to scare this guy. This is frustrating. This is really, really frustrating. She's gonna end up drowning. Okay, we have little baby Reven. Hide in the grass. Um, sit here. Swipe it. Gosh darn it, she can't get it. Collect from this. And I think Anar is going to try to come over and help. Just just to try and make sure they're safe. Ah, oh, this is frustrating. This is so frustrating. But uh, Iris is taking charge and protecting her little brother right now. Oh! Was it swiped down? Did it die? Looks like it died. I guess she killed it. Okay. So Izlaiz, actually why don't you go ahead and help out over here, watch after them, and maybe help out your little girl, because she's in danger. Oh, this is so dangerous, so dangerous. And actually before Scarlet collects that, I think I'm going to go ahead and have Poison Flower do it. Uh, use up her turns, and then we're going to go ahead and send Scarlet back. We're sending Scarlet back, and we're actually going to send Poison Flower over this way, too. I just, I don't want them to be too close to those trees, and it, it just, it's dangerous, it's dangerous, it's dangerous, it's dangerous. But, uh, we have roots trying to be gathered right now. Swiftwing is doing his best to gather from it. Ah, oh, come on, let him get the roots, let him get the roots. But, uh, I think, I think, um, I think, I forgot her name for a second, I think Scarlet's going to go over and try to help out. Anasi, don't get any funny ideas. Don't get any funny ideas. Okay. So we have Anasi. Cardi is trying to scoot her way up here. She's trying to help by clearing out the paths. And I guess she'll sit here. We're trying our best to clear out a path that's as far away from the trees as possible. But I think a lot of the younger Nietzschelings might just go by the beach. So these guys are just looking for food now more than anything else. We have everybody over here. Okay. 
Scoot. Inward, please. Oh gosh, Pear is searching for something. A bunny, apparently. I really wish we could get there, ugh, but um, Rune is not fast enough. I guess it depends on where the bunny goes. Oh, I really hate that. You had to do that. Ah. Oh no, Tulip's all alone. Tulip. Tulip, not good. Not good, Tulip. Tulip, sit here. You suck, bunny. I think Runa's gonna come back over this way. Oh, now that's just mocking. That's just mocking us. It's mean. You're mean. Bullying. Swipe it? Okay, I guess not. We didn't get any extra berries from that. We have 26. Uh... Mocha still following after Velvet as, as sneakily as she can. She's not as good at sneaking around. Okay. So we have quite a few things going on. Still no apes that we've run into. Very nervous. But we're getting closer and closer to these ports. So these guys are going to work like crazy on building a path there. And everybody else is going to work on keeping food up. And actually, no more babies. No more babies! Because, oh my goodness, I can't. I just can't. As much as I want them to have more, I think instead we're just going to make sure everybody breeds before we go, and that's that. So no more babies. We have our 10 selected, and that's how it's going to be. But, uh, okay. Let's just pass the turn. Please tell me you're about to grow up. You're not, are you? Ugh. Uh. Okay. I heard something. I don't like what I heard. I don't like it, but let's actually, let's get Isana out of the water, get her out. Um, she can try to fish this one. And are you going to try to swipe at this? I think he's going to. Come on. Wait. And are you going to try now? Oh, he got it. Why don't you try now? Ah, oh, we got it. We got the meat. Yes, 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 yes. How wonderful. Okay, so now that that's done, oh, I hope she didn't take the berries. I just realized she probably could have. How awful. But I think Wineberry is going to start leading her family this way through everything. She's going to see her mate, uh, Einar, and she's going to guide her family over this way. And Elias, since they've all been pretty good friends, she's going to follow after them. But she's going to wait for her daughter instead. She will follow, but she's waiting for her daughter. Iris is scooting over bit by bit. And I think we have Anar over here. Anar doesn't really want to leave all this behind, but I think they're going to anyway. I'm tempted. I'm tempted to go back to that place, but I mean, there are more berry bushes. <gasps> but it's okay. It's okay. It's Lies is just uh, waiting for her daughter. We only have nine food. Oh, this is awful. Okay, so Tulip, gather from this berry bush. And Runa, we need you to sit over here. What? I said sit! Yeah, no! Oh, he only has one turn, doesn't he? Wait, she can do it! She can do it! Get the bunny! Okay, so she'll... No, 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 no. Swipe the bunny. Collect the meat. Maybe sit up here and see if you can't... I don't know if there are any berries over here. So let's go ahead, let's zoom out. And there is another berry bush up here. I totally forgot. Oh my gosh. Scoot. Ah, oh, nasty. Okay. We do, however, have a tree. So let's... Let's move everybody. Yeah, that's right. Run away. You meanie. You bully. You thief. How dare you. But I'm not sure quite... You know what? No. I think Raduknu is going to stay here. He's going to stay and help out with collecting and fishing while he can. We actually have Cardi over here. Okay, so we almost got through this part. We're almost through this part, and we're actually not too far from the ports. They just have to do a lot of clearing. A lot of clearing. So we'll do our best with that, and everybody over here is still desperately, desperately scrounging for food. And I think Swiftwing is going to... So desperate, he goes for the leech. And we at least have 16... And she's going to try to dig for roots. Oh, come on. Come on. We need to have enough food. We absolutely need to have enough food. Why couldn't, Why wouldn't it let me collect? That's so mean. Okay, so somebody's going to get hurt. I don't know who. Um, 
I think one of the older Meechlings might end up taking the hit. I don't know. Runa? It takes so much of their life, though. That's what bugs me. It takes a lot. It takes a lot off their life. <sighs> We're gonna have quite a few. There's gonna be three. Three Meechlings that suffer because of this. I don't know who, and I don't know who I'd want to pin this on. But... It might kill quite a few of them, but you know what, Redukunu is about to pass away anyway. So I guess we'll change him to Omega. Redukunu is about to pass away, I think Pear is about to pass away, so we can go ahead and change him to Omega too. And I don't know anybody else who really would take the damage, but I do think Runa would. And that's just her personality, so she's going to take the damage, and we're going to have to pass the turn. Oh no. Where? Well, isn't that great? Sarcasm! Do you guys know what sarcasm is? Because it's. It is different. <gasps> food! Food, food, food! Food, 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 food! First off, grab this. Second off, Runa, smack this. Third off, can you. You have two moves. Good. Gather from this. Gather. Okay. So, okay, okay, okay. Do we have any other niche links that can make it over there? She's gathering berries. She's gathering berries. She's busy gathering berries. Ah, I hate how grassy everything is. I hate that I can't clear everything out. Ugh, ugh, frustrating. Um, I guess he tried to swipe at it, but fail because he can't. And Scarlet, it's still trying, she's still trying to dig this up. And... Uh, raspberry ripple what are you gonna do man I don't know what everybody's trying to do I think she'll move this way I think uh, uh, I, 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 but what's so annoying is that she has to clear this part open try to fish that up oh more fish yes thank goodness maybe somebody could double team a crab it perhaps oh, I don't think that's gonna happen um, let's have everybody move then. We need to gather berries. So I think Wineberry will take over. Gather from this. Uh, and so will her son. And her mate is going to scoot forward. <gasps> did she find it? Did he just find another berry bush? You totally just found another berry bush. You did just find another berry bush. Darn it, I wish I had paid attention. I. Uh, Okay. Mocha, gather this. There we go. We have just enough. And we have more now. I didn't want to swipe down the berry bush because I wanted to have enough. <sighs> but at the very least, I think... Oh gosh. Eh. Eh. We have a carnivore over here. Darn it. So, Kutakir, you actually have the most strength. So instead, let's smell. So there's a healing plant right here. Well, well, well. How interesting. Um, she has a lot of strength. Well, she doesn't have a lot of strength, actually. Let me look. Let me look at you. She has two strength. So Kadi is going to try to attack. Velvet might as well, but I think she might call Kut uh, Kutakir over because he has more strength and he'll swipe. The Barina has only a little bit of life left, but she's going to get berries first, and then she'll attack. Oh! She only had two moves! That's great! That's wonderful! We have the healing plant here, though, so whoever gets hit, if she gets hit, she can just snatch that up straight away. Oh, the jungle is so stressful. Oh my goodness, it is so stressful, but at least we have enough food and some extra to tide us over. Let's pass the turn. Oh, who got hurt? Uh, clamshell! Clamshell! Get it! Get it, get it, get it! Boom! Okay, so let's go, let's, let's just deal with this situation over here right now. We're just going to deal with this situation and get this done. It is so hard to see you guys. It is so hard to see you in all of this grass. So ridiculously hard. Let's go ahead, zoom in just a little bit. And I don't know who was hit. But now we have a lot of extra food. It was Kadi! Kadi, no! She's gonna die no matter what because she, I should have had Velvet collect the food. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, Kadi. Kadi, I'm sorry. But I think, I think she's okay. I think, 
we're gonna collect from this and not actually actually collect but velvet is going to continue making the path towards the jungle ports so she's continuing on her way and he actually passed away and I think Mocha is following very slowly after everybody. And it looks like there's fish here that she could try to go for. And we have everybody over here. Collect. 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 And all the food is, is gone from here. Okay, all the food's gone from here. Runa is clearing away stuff. Oh my gosh, I hate how crowded it all is. I really hate the grass. I really hate that I can't clear it up, too. Dig. No roots. That's okay. Swiftwing is going around the beach. I think I think he might actually advise everybody. All of these Nichlings that are currently trying to go through this way, Mocha's going to go through this way no matter what, but I think he's going to encourage everybody to take the long way around instead. Because it actually isn't the long way around. It is faster. So he's going to start doing that. And then we have her. We have Poison Flower. And I think she's just going to swipe down this berry bush. Because uh, Swiftwing, he, he's impatient. He's feeling impatient. So I think he's going to start really trying to move everybody. And Tulip is going to try to stay in the grass most of the time. But she's trying to keep it lit up. We have Isana. And she's going to go with her mom and search for everything. Who's going to swipe at this leech, which is more food. Uh, good, good. Very good. And I think Wineberry will gather from this, and she'll sit here, which there is another berry bush. Oh, thank goodness. Anar, Anar, swipe from that. And your son is going to hop around you and scoot this way, and your daughter is also going to scoot this way. Okay, so we're making progress. We have a couple of our nichelings getting pretty close to the ports. They still have a little ways to go, but they're actually fairly close, and Velvet's almost there herself. So we're almost there. We're getting there. All right. We're starting to build up our food too since we've decided we are no longer breeding until we're leaving. And the niche links that we're going to pair together, we're going to have them breed soon so that the second we get anywhere, we're ready to continue, like continue the lines and the generations and stuff. So let's go ahead. Let's look at Raspberry. I think Raspberry can breed with someone. I think it was actually with Mocha. Let's let's look at Angie. She has A and G. So he and Mocha can breed. So when they reach the porch, they're going to go ahead and they're going to breed. And we know Swiftwing and Scarlet can breed. And I think they're going to go ahead and he's going to proclaim her, her, his mate. And there we go. Okay, so Scarlet, you are actually the next chief. Well, sort of. You are you are the uh, chiefess. Chiefess? <laughs> But uh, there we go. So she has the mark of one of the leaders. And everybody over here is good. Okay. Pass the turn. Alright. Alright. What's going on? We lost Kadi. We lost Kadi. Kari, no. And listen, so far we're doing... I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I'm terrified right now. I'm so nervous. But I think the order is clear. Everybody is to move and leave. Mocha's already made up her mind to go this way. She has already decided this is where she's heading. She is taking the the, the route that uh, that Velvet took. So she's going to swim. And she's going to make her way over. And Kutakir, he's staying here to look after everything. And, and attempt to crack nuts. He's actually going to have to start clearing away some of the grass too. So... Velvet only has two turns. I think she's going to clear away the grass ahead of her. And we have these guys all moved, and everybody over here needs to get moving. So I think Scarlet is actually going to start scooting along the water. Just a little bit, just so she can hopefully gather stuff. And Ripple's going to try to gather that root, but he's also going to start moving. I don't know what Poison Flower wants to do, but I think she's going to try to help um, get food as well. Oh, she isn't able to. Oh well, she tried. But uh, everybody over here, now Runa, okay, if, when that thing grows back, it's going to grow back mean. I think she's going to help her son, Roar, 
get over here. And Roar's gonna start scooting over this way. Speaking of which, Roar and Isana. Nope. Not not happening. It's not gonna happen. Maybe they could double team a Krabbit, but he can't really... I think we're just gonna scoot. We're just gonna scoot. And Mama Elias, I think she recognizes she's not going to the next island. So she's gonna gather from these berries. And I think Wineberries accepted this as well. So she's gathering from the berries, and then she's gonna go further in in the hopes of finding a berry bush, another berry bush. And her mate, he's gonna go further in too, and it looks like there's a green plant up here that we could possibly swipe down later. But Anar, he's gonna scoot a little further in in the hopes of finding and helping out his mate. But they've decided to stay, and their children are going to help lead the next, the next group. So they're all going that way, and they're heading, they're heading out of here. Sorry about that, somebody knocked on the door, but alright! Ah, uh, okay, okay, I don't know if we have any other Nietzschelings that I need to move besides you, but I'm trying to kind of keep some of you guys in your areas to help us um, keep the place lit up. But we're definitely, definitely focusing on hunting these guys. Runa, Runa, Runa. Maybe you could. You're not gonna be able to help. Okay. Um. Actually, you know what, Tulip, you might be able to. Maybe. I don't know if the water would be too deep if I sat him down there. Gosh, we can't get that crab, it can we? I just wanna. I just want food for everybody. I think Tulip's gonna sit here. And. She can't do anything. Darn it. <sighs> okay. Okay. So Scarlet's gonna I think I think Swiftwing is gonna come back to make sure his mate is making making it okay. And we'll make sure that all of the pairs breed before we go, so let's see. Um nope no no no. We have Swiftwing and uh Scarlet together. We have Raspberry Ripple and Mocha together. We have Roar, who has B and G. He won't be able to breed with Tulip, but he might be able to breed. No, B and I. Um, maybe with Iris? She is I and Home Island. Okay, actually, I think Iris and Roar can breed. So I'm just going to go ahead and add red there. So red there as well. So, you know, I might as well just change all your gems to red Iris. But she can breed with, um, she can breed with Roar. And we have G and A. He can breed with Isana! Isana! Well, how cute! Childhood friends falling in love, that's adorable! They actually all need red gems. Okay, that's super cute. Alright, we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna pass the turn. After one last sniff, and one last listen, I'm kind of hoping to get them on the ports, or like, right by the ports today, so we're gonna see. Oh, somebody passed away! Somebody passed away! Oh, we don't have enough food now, and if we smell, it's gonna be- oh, it's still green? It's still green? Oh my gosh, he might have to make a pit stop. Let's wait though, let's wait. We're gonna wait. I don't think anybody else has been leeched. Um... Why don't you try scooting further ahead, Raspberry? Cause Scarlet actually seems like she can move faster than you. Oh, you guys can double team! Apparently not now! Darn it. Okay, so Tulip, I don't know if Tulip can really breed with anybody, but uh, that's okay. She's gonna go anyway, and she's very, very speedy, so she'll go. And we could get more food there, but I think I'm gonna wait. Everybody over here is gonna work on gathering food. And they might start swiping things down soon. She's gonna gather. And he's gonna actually go over here, because there might be some acorns. Yes, there are! Perfect! So he can go ahead and help us that way, and I think... I think Wineberry's just going to try to dig up some roots. Same with, um, Isla's, or Elias. And Isana is going to scoot closer herself. So everybody over here is moving as far as they can, and Iris is running, running, running. She really wants to get out of here. Her brother is leading the way very determinedly. And they're all rounding the corner. They're almost there. 
Yeah, you guys, they're so much faster. It is so much faster this way. I was just hoping to give us a bit more of a challenge. But I think I think he's going to stay there. And before I move anybody over here, we're actually going to scoot little Mocha um, forward. And I think you need to really uh, clear up some of this mess, buddy. You need to clear up some of this mess so that she can get through easier. And she might end up just swiping down the berry bush, but she is going to, ah, uh, don't you confuse me. She's going to go here. She's going to go here, and Velvet is going to scoot forward. We have a couple of those terrible patches, those horrible, horrible patches of noise-making grass, but that's okay. She's going to wind herself down, and I think... Reven's just going to scoot closer to the ports. So now that we've done that, I think that's going to be it for this episode. It's quite a long one, and oh, of course, crab it. So rude. So we're going to be waiting and seeing. Oh, swipe it, swipe it! Oh, good, 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 good. Hopefully we actually get something there. But we don't have enough food, so that's awful. Um, I don't know what he can do. Dig? Oh, we barely got enough. Thank you, Roar. Thank you. That is seriously exactly enough for us to survive. But all right, I do think that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I want to thank you all for watching. But I'm going to be bopping on out of here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.